Jumpstarting Sustainable Civilizations, One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 64. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution-creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for-profit and non-profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 Nonprofit Organization. This is our weekly progress update number 64, covering our team's progress, accomplishments, uh, pictures, everything that we've achieved for the week of May 12th, 2014. As always, if you'd like more details, more specifics, links to all the open source content, visit our written blog. And if you'd like to be added to our email list where you'll receive an email every time one of these updates comes out, just send an update to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com and we'll add you to our newsletter list. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes California state education standards. This week, the core team, which consists of the satellite and Pioneer members, researched and added the first 20% of links connecting our math page to the open source and free shared Khan Academy educational program for teaching everything there. Behind the scenes, we also finished researching and creating a free online education resource guide to all other open source educational programs and resources we found covering all subjects and ages. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined, and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week, the core team working on Highest Good Food added stairs, berms, and external elements to the complete Aquapini and Wallapini footprint in 3D. You can see those here. We also fixed some piping issues and added the railings to the central water storage pond. In addition to this, we are now about 60% done with the professional planting plans, the maps for the 18 hoop houses we'll be starting with. We just need to finish four more and add all the plant labels to the specific grow zones because all the plants have already been chosen. And, uh, and the complete open source details for building these are already on the website and we'll put the rest of this up on the website too. Uh, we also finished the diversity details to the heirloom celery section of the large scale gardening page this last week and that now offers 18 different varieties from around the world, nine featured and complete sourcing details for all of them. Behind the scenes, our horticulturists and botanists are now 90% done with our soil amendment strategy details for land preparation in areas without, with uh, poor soil. And this last week we added mushroom cultivation specifics and composting details and now we're working on labor projection specifics and a page will be coming up uh, soon with all of that to share all this amazing work and information that we've been doing behind the scenes. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master electrician and a master plumber if you would like to help out. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week's core team working on highest good housing began our equipment schedule for the entire village and duplicable city center, which you can see here. We also began in-depth research on remote internet installation for the Earthbag Village and the complete property. 
In this area of the project, we are seeking a Wi-Fi network designer and a master plumber. If anyone would like to help or knows someone who might like to help us finish this open source model. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team created the open source duplicable city center kitchen page for the open source kitchen facility that will be providing food for 150 to 200 people at a time and preserving food for hundreds more. Uh, Rick Ruggles with Hayward Pool Products, working in conjunction with Jennifer Engelmeyer with uh, loveyournaturalpool.com, calculated our power supply needs for the open source natural pool and spa. Details are now on the website. And Daku finished his initial calculations for heat loss for the swimming pool. These are also on the website. Last but not least, Carl Harris redesigned our dome windows in CAD as he continues to work on all of the CAD elevations for this structure. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week, the core team working on the highest good society component completely rewrote our communication page, adding in specifics about what this core value means to us and how we use it in our decision-making and ongoing development process. Guy Fraser, uh, also completed a massive amount of research on how we may be able to use WordPress to build our global plant collaboration uh, database. Visit our written blog for those details too. One community is jumpstarting sustainable civilizations through open source creation. We've got a detailed strategy that we talk about all over our website for creating the open source and free shared foundations for self-sufficiency and sustainability to be applied either individually or as complete teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and educational hubs to be built around the world. The whole point here is that if we make it easy enough, if we make it affordable enough, and if we make it and we demonstrate it as attractive enough, we know that this idea will spread on its own. And so the strategy is pretty simple. You know, if our goal is to be the change that we want to be, want to see in the world, if our goal is to positively and permanently transform this planet for everyone, and that is our goal, then doesn't it make sense to create an open source and free shared foundation that people will be able to take and adapt to their own individual needs that is streamlined and all pointing in the same direction of creating and living for the highest good of all of humanity, for all life on this planet? This is our idea for jumpstarting sustainable civilizations. You gotta build the foundations, right? We're building the foundations, we're creating the infrastructure, we're creating the detailed plans, the do-it-yourself instructions, and then by making that affordable enough and making it attractive enough and showing people how to do it, why they should do it, and what, how it specifically, individually benefits everybody who participates, then the ideal spread on its own. And a self-replicating solution like that, a solution model, that creates additional solution creating models has the potential to make history. It's like a 3D printer that prints itself and once you get that in the hands of enough people then people can continue to contribute to the global collaborative adding more and more knowledge to that in information database so that more and more people can participate and have more and more options to create self-sufficiency and sustainability and to spread and share it with more and more people around the world. This is our open source strategy. This is what one community is all about. We believe that better is possible and we're carrying the consciousness for the highest good of all to bring that to as many people as we possibly can. And we're calling out to the people that want to be a part of something like this, to people that realize that we can do something different. We have a choice, but somebody's not gonna do it for us. 
And so we're bringing these, bringing the folks together. We're bringing together the makers, the creators, the architects, the engineers of the future, the people that want to be a part of the change, the people that want to make history, the people that want to leave a legacy, the people that want to see our great, 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 great grandchildren living in a world that's completely transformed and different from what it is that we're living right now, positively and permanently moving in the direction so that it can sustain life indefinitely and so it's regenerative. So it's good for all people, it's good for all life on this planet, and so that humanity becomes the true conscious stewards that we're capable of being on this planet, making it better. So if this sounds fun to you, if this is something that you would like to participate in, is this something that you would like to join us in, we invite you to get involved. Become a part of our team. We're building the pioneer group, which is the core group that's going to move on to the property and build everything that is one community. And then we're also continuing to grow our group of collaborative partners and consultants who are helping us behind the scenes to put all this stuff together and to create everything that you see. And these are the people that we report on every single week when we say, ah, oh, this person did this, this person did that. Those are all of our collaborative partners that have contributed to some amazing things and keep us moving forward. Every single week we're putting out open source content. We continue to evolve what it is that we're doing. And, uh, and so we say thank you for everybody that's following us. As always, if you'd like to uh, follow us on social media, we are on every single social media network. We are on Facebook. We are on LinkedIn. We are on Tumblr. We are on Pinterest. We are on Reddit. You name it, we are on all the different social media networks out there. And, uh, and of course, we're still looking for that, that large-scale funder that will help us get the property off the market, either investing in our 501c3 nonprofit, donating to it rather, or investing in us. Uh, so we can get that property off the market and take this whole project to a completely different level. If we could share the location, I guarantee that we would build our team three or four times faster than we are right now. I mean, this project would explode if we could share the lo location because we get emails fairly frequently from people that say, oh, you know, as soon as you tell, as soon as we know where you're at, you know, that would really make a difference in my decision-making process. You know, and lots of people have said, hey, we've been watching your project for years. So, you know, and it only takes one person. It only takes one person with the resources to invest in us, or it only takes one person to share what it is that we're doing with the people who have the resources. And so this is our shout-out, this is our call-out, and of course this is our expression of gratitude to everybody that donates to our project. The small donations allow us to continue to move forward. We are all uh, unpaid volunteers, including myself. And so all the donations that we get go straight into this project, keeping it running, keeping the website running, and everything uh, above and beyond that goes into a fund for the property. So this is what we're up to. This is what we're doing. And uh, if you'd like to be added to our newsletter, um, by all means, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com or subscribe to this channel, and you'll get updates every time one of these, uh, one of these updates comes out in your inbox. And as always... Um, Thanks for following our progress. Until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thank you.